Hey, welcome to my channel. I'm Marty, and today I want to show you some free plugins that you can use for your guitar and your bass. So these plugins are like emulations of real guitar pedals, for example, and those plugins are from TCE. I'm going to show you how they actually work, how they sound. I'm going to use it with guitar and with a bass. Um, and I would say let's jump right in and I'm going to show you the first one, which is called the TCE 808 looks like that. Um, so standard guitar pedal as you might have in real on your pedal board for example and it actually is pretty simple you have a drive knob a volume and a tone where you can actually um, increase or decrease the high frequency content and the low frequency content so it gets darker or brighter. Um, down there you have also the option for stereo if you use it in stereo mode or here is also a quality for low and high quality. Um, and the input slider down there. All right, so um, I'm gonna engage now just the DI guitar. It's plugged in just into um, a standard amplifier, um, which is a TL Audio 5050 in that case. And that's the basic tone. Um, what I'm using here is just a Logic amp, which is obviously um, a Vox simulation um, with no drive, just a little of a gain, so pretty clean. And what I have here also is on the bus the H delay, I'm going to show you first without and then with. So this is not a sound um, without the pedal. Let's bring it in. So in that case, I have the drive pretty low. Um, it really has a nice break up in the high end. And that's oftentimes you just want, you want this little over the top. Um, where it actually kind of like is a little bit distorting. Um, but just for the heck of it, I'm going to show you what the drive does. So let's increase it a little bit. Maybe even a little more. So it's now heavily distorting. Let's see what the tone does. So let's push it all the way down. So that's very dark sounding. Let's push it all the way up. Okay, let's maybe bring it a little bit back again. And let's push the drive also a little back. And let's bring in here a delay, which is H delay, um, eighth notes. So pretty, nothing fancy there, all right? But together with the TC-808 here is a very nice thick tone. Again, without the pedal. And 
with. Alright, so that was the first pedal and let's move on to the next one. Alright, so change the guitar, um, Les Paul style guitar here. And I'm gonna show you now the second plugin, which is the TCR47, looks like that. And I used here also a different amp, which is kind of like a Marshall recreation here, um, with a big cabinet, um, pretty clean here. All right, and now, um, be prepared for some major distortion. I was actually really surprised by this. Um, I have it now here in just a little bit over the half um, of drive um, with a filter, which is essentially the same as on the other plug-in um, for brightness or for um, a little bit more low end, so darker or brighter sounding. Um, volume knob and of course here as on all the TCE plug-ins, stereo quality and a input. Right, so um, now just with, let's say, half drive here, I'm gonna play a little bit. Sounds like that. All right, let's push it back here. That's basically a little more like you would use, for example, for a blues. Let's bring the filter in here also. Let's push it all the way up. So very dark. Let's push it again in the middle here, for example. It's a little bit more drive. All right, again, just a little bit more. Let's make it even brighter. distortion here and now let's push it really over the top and push it all the way up so you can really hear here another drive distortion here. Again, that's without. All right, and with. Man, love this plugin. That's really great sounding. All right, so third and last plugin, which you probably have guessed, a bass plugin. Um, it is the TCE BOD, looks like that. 
and um, you get a little bit more knobs and features here. So first of all, you get a level here, um, then you get the drive knob, then you can change the low and the high frequencies. Um, you got also a blend um, that you can mix the BOD with the original signal. Um, you got the presense and again quality, high and low, and an activation knob and the input adjustment, right? This is the bass without anything. All right, so stand at the eye base. And now let's bring it in. And it sounds like that. So already much fuller sounding. Um, let's leave the level here and let's push the drive back. Okay, and now let's see what the lows do. So bring it all the way back. Push it fully. Yeah. Wow. Turn it back again. So the highs all the way down. And let's push it all the way up just for the sake of it. Okay. Then you got also plant knob. So this is the original. And now with the POD. And of course a presence here. So that's fully down. And now all the way up. Okay. All right, so I would say let's push in a little bit of a drive here, maybe some low and a little bit of the highs and leave the plant all the way here. Now we're talking. Okay, just for the sake of it, let's bring also in a little bit of drums. So we have a little bit of a groove. See how that sounds. And let's maybe push it out so we have a reference here. Okay, and let's push it in again, maybe with a little bit less drive. Right, so I'm not a really sophisticated bass player when we play guitar, but I think that sounds really great. All right, so those are the free plugins. I think they sound really great. Again, they are free. Um, I have the download links in the description below. Um, so feel free just to download them, try it out if you like it. Um, maybe you have other plugins um, that you're a little more fond of, but I really, really do like, especially the TCE R47 here, the base, the BOD plugin. Um, yeah, so thanks for watching. Um, please subscribe if you want to see more videos like that in the future. And as always, see you in the next video.